hi, hello, how are you? I'm Kia and today I'm going to be doing my first episode of Bookish Baking. So I'm obviously here in my kitchen to start this off. I know my shirt has literally nothing to do with things bookish, but I'm going to be baking some treats that are related to books or inspired by books. So today to kick things off, I'm going to be making blue chocolate chip cookies. And if you do not know why that is bookish, go read Percy Jackson and the Olympians, The Lightning Thief, come back, and then we can start. So let's get into it. Great guys. I'm gonna put some water. This is this could be my downfall. Brown sugar. Brown sugar actually like, sucks. The consistency is like really rude. What are chocolate chip cookies without chocolate chips? Because they're not sugar cookies and I don't get it. Oh my god, look at me. Cookie. This is when I was really into baking. Just look at the color. This looks so gross. <laughs> All right, time for more time. Let me know in the comments any like book suggestions or bookish, or not bookish, or like baking things you want me to make. I was say like, what is there? Like there's cake, there's cupcakes, there's cookies, pies. That's like about it. So don't be worried if your batter looks green, because mine looks really green. Percy Jackson overall is underrated, as well as his mother. His mother is one of the best mother characters. This isn't even a tribute to Percy, this is just to his mom. This looks so bad. I 
think I'm gonna give up soon. I'm gonna put in some chocolate chips. I'm using my toaster oven because my oven is on a bit of a hiatus. What even happened here? I'm gonna do this in the Um, so she's not doing the best, but it's okay. All right, so now what you're gonna wanna do this is a technique I learned from my grand mom. Get a little spoon. You gotta roll it in your hands. You're gonna flatten it a little bit with your palm. Dog. I'm gonna put these in. All right, so these are the completed cookies. They're not the bluest cookies I've ever seen, but it is tricky and the thought is what counts. And they are super, super good. Um, I did use whole wheat flour, so they're not as good as maybe normal flour would be. But you know what? They're cute and they're bookish. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Like, comment, subscribe, do all the things, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!